Hello guys, it's my pleasure to welcome you to my channel, it's a Graphics and Multimedia. Uh, my name is Rafiu Yakub. I'm reaching you from Lagos State, Nigeria. And in this video, guys, I'm going to teach you guys how to fund your Alipay to pass step by step without any stress. Uh, but before I get to the tutorial started, if you are very new to this channel, remember to click on the subscribe. Click on the notification bell also whenever I upload content about China importation, you get notified and you watch the video. And lastly but not the least, if you would like to join my paid class, you can connect with me via the phone number on the screen of this video. And also, if you want me to pay your Chinese supplier or you want me to procure your link on 1688 Tahoba or Indodo, you can as well connect with me on via the same phone number on the screen of this video. Let us talk more about importation business if you have interest. And also, if you would like to check some of the previous tutorials I have made about China importation, U.S., Turkey and uh, India in position. All you have to do is to make sure you visit Excel Graphics and Multimedia. Then when you visit my channel, remember to click on the playlist right here. You click on playlist right here. So when you click on playlist, it takes you to this page. Then you have to scroll down and uh, click on uh, importation class right here. So when you click on that, you'll be able to see more current and previous tutorial I have made about China importation using 1688, uh, China importation using Tahoba, and China importation using uh, Pindodo, China importation using uh, uh, using uh, Idle Fish, and uh, Alipay related topic, uh, Indian importation, WeChat topics, etc. So all you have to do is to watch the video, watch related topic that has to do with your importation issue so without wasting much of our time so let's go straight to the tutorial and see how you can fund your alipay to pass using your mastercard so let's get started so the first thing you need to do guys is to uh, head over to your alipay right here this is my alipay so you click on alipay So when your Halipay open up, next thing you have to tap on Toll Pass right here. You tap on Toll Pass. Right, so uh, this is how your Toll Pass is going to open up. So a brief overview about Toll Pass for the purpose of people that doesn't know what Toll Pass is all about. So Toll Pass right here can be used for uh, can be used for non-Chinese. So you can read what Topaz is all about, what is Topaz, who can use Topaz, top-up limitation, uh, validity period of Topaz, and uh, uh, top-up fill, etc. So uh, a brief overview about Topaz is just that Topaz allow you to fund your account with your local bank card at a maximum of 10,000 RMB. You can use Topaz as a non-Chinese. You can use your foreign card to fund the account and you can use store pass to pay on on uh, any chinese e-commerce platform online those are the things you can use store pass to do so you cannot use store pass to transfer to another alipay account you, you need to understand the facts so for you to fund this account all you have to do is to make sure you click on use now right here so when you click on use now it takes you to a page whereby you need to fill in your information so at this point here you need to click on here to choose your region so here you select your country so I have to scroll down and then look for my country right here so this is my country so i'm going to select on that so having selected your country uh you have to prepare provide uh, pre um, some of the necessary information passport number that is international passport number name on or uh, uh, name on your passport expire date your date of birth and uh, you have to scroll down and fill all the necessary information right here okay so I'm going to fill in the passport detail.
you have to fill it correctly so when you fill in the passport detail you move to name on the passport or should be in capital letter so you have to put it exactly the way it was written on your passport then you move to expire date so you set that So once you are, you are done with settings, click on OK. So that is that. Then you move to your date of birth, which must be correspond to what you have on your passport. Then click on OK. Then you move to gender. You have to select your gender. Anyway, you can leave it right down to see. Then you move to your occupation right here. So you can choose any of the occupation that are related or just pick anyone you would like to, to use as your occupation. So when you select your occupation, you have to come here and take photo. Click on take photo. So by then you should must have your international passport beside you so that you can take the picture live. So here you click on take photo. Then you must have seen the instruction. So your passport must be in this format. So that is only when they can approve your, your passport. So when you are done, then click on got it. So I go to open up the camera and uh, you can take the passport live. So you have to position your camera. And snap. Right, so when you are done with snapping of the passports, then click on use photo. Use photo. So you can see that the passport has been successfully uploaded. So you have to come here and enter your residential address. You click on that, then you select your region which is your country. Select your country, then you enter your address. Okay, 
Then you come to the turn. Then you enter the state. Then you enter your your zip code. So you have to search for your zip code. You can search for that on Google if you don't know your zip code. So you have to enter your zip code. Then when you are done, just click on OK right here. Click on OK. Then it's going to be load up. So the next thing you have to do is to click on Next right here. So after you click on next, it takes you to where you will need to enter your fund. So uh, you can tap on 100 RMB to activate your tour pass. So when you tap on 100 RMB, you will be asked to click on next again. Click on next. Then it will take you to where you need to enter your card detail. So. I have to enter my card information right away. So the card number, you have to enter your card number. So having enter your card number, you have to enter the expired date then click on ok then the three digit code at the back of your card you have to enter that also when you are done click on here So uh, finally, click on top up 100 RMB. Then here, just click on confirm and pay. And click on top up, confirm and pay. Boom. So you can see now that the phone has been loaded successfully. We are able to load 100 RMB to this particular uh, top pass account. So the next thing you have to do is to click on OK. Click on OK. Boom. So you can see now that this top pass here is going to be valid until September 3rd, 2022. Uh, we have successfully found this account with 100 RMB. Now you can, if you want to top more into this account, all you have to do is to click on top up. So we click on top up, then you had more fund. You can continue like that to top more into this particular account. So guys, the money you have right here is what you are going to use to make payment to supplier directly on 1688 Tahova or Pindudu or Idufish or any Chinese e-commerce platform that accepts Alipay as a means of payment. So this is how you uh, fund your Alipay toll pass using your uh, bank card step by step without any stress. All you have to do is to follow the step I'm taking in this video and see how you get it done. If you enjoyed this video, give this video a big thumb up. And also, if you have any question for me as far as this tutorial is concerned, can you put your question in the comment section down below? I'll be glad to reply to whatsoever question you might have for me. And lastly, but not the least, if you would like me to coach you step by step on how you too can be a successful independent agent, you want to pay your supplier by yourself, you want to procure everything by yourself, you you're interested to join my paid class you can connect with me if you have the same phone number on the screen of this video and if you want me to procure your link on 1688 tahoba or on pindodo you can as well connect with me if you have the same phone number on the screen of this video on whatsapp thank you guys for watching this video from the beginning to the end and i hope to see you guys in my next video bye for now